Okay, so here we have Bella Beats Leaf. Um, it is a smart piece of jewelry and a health tracker or activity tracker. Um, it is designed specifically for women. They wanted it to look good, not just like other fitness trackers. It can be worn as a necklace, a bracelet, brooch, that kind of thing. It's also a period tracker. Uh, it allows you to keep better track of your cycle. You can even see how your sleep quality changes during the cycle. Um, and it's not only fitness oriented, it's about achieving balance and well-being through sleep tracking and breathing exercises. The way the Leaf works is it's through the Leaf app. Uh, it can be downloaded free on the Apple Store or Google Play, depending on whether you have an iPhone or an Android. Um, and yeah, let's take a look at it. Okay, here we go. Let's see if I can do this without hurting myself. Okay. Okay, so really nice packaging here. Here's the leaf itself. It actually is really pretty. This is a silver model. There's other models, if I understand correctly. Um, I think there's a gold one and a rose gold one. Uh, and the case itself here, it actually uh, is magnetic, so it would fall back really nicely in there. So this is made of hyperallergenic stainless steel, so you don't have to worry about allergies or skin reactions, which I think is really great. And it looks like this is how we get it started. We pull this, and I'm sure now the battery works. There we go. Pretty neat. Um, it's good size, actually. It's almost not quite statement jewelry, but it's really good size. If you see here, I've got it's about the size of my thumb. Um, I've got smallish hands, but still kind of give you the idea right there. Put that aside for a second. So let's see what else we've got in here. So it's a nice, actually it's a nice little case itself. It's got a, a base to it. So if you ever wanted to pop it back in there, yeah, it's it's got a magnet in there. So it'll stick in there really nicely if you want to showpiece it or have it hang out on your dresser or something like that. Looks like we've got the manual here. Um, I think this is actually fairly user friendly, so I'm not sure we'll be using this, but we will of course hang on to it because you never know. And here's a really great example of the different ways that the leaf can be worn. Um, I'm especially interested in this one right here, this bracelet. Um, it's uh, It takes a little figuring out from what I understand. Um, so the company did make a tutorial. You can check it out in the link um, down below. Uh, if you have a little bit of trouble with it yourself, I'm sure we'll figure it out together, though. All right, we've got some accessories here. Uh, this is the bracelet that I was so interested in. So this is made of suede. Uh, okay, so we're back. My camera's having some overheating issues. I think we were talking about the suede bracelet here. Made with suede, only been treated with natural colors, so it's skin friendly and safe. This is the one that um, they have a tutorial for on their website in case you can't um, get how it works right away, but I think we can figure that out. So you can wear this a couple different ways, I guess. Additionally, it also has really nicely packaged here silver necklace. Pulling it out the wrong way. There we go. Oh, it's really pretty, actually. I would absolutely wear this as a piece of jewelry. Um, this one uh, is, again, stainless steel, hyperallergenic. And let's check it out. And there you go. Comes a necklace. Let's check it out. Is this bracelet here? Uh, 
Okay, so clip goes here. That was pretty easy. We're gonna leave that right there. Oh, I've got it on backwards. Hang on, let's try that again. There we go. And we wrap it around. And then it goes into this little bit here. Oh, guys, hang on. Got a really nice little protective shield back here for you. So you just need to peel that off. There we go. And now we should be able to get it in here. Oh, yeah, no problem. Okay, so, sorry, we're back. Lost, uh, lost power on my camera. But here we have the leaf being used as a bracelet, which I think is really, really pretty. Um, and I thought I'd show you guys how we get it all set up. So, what I've done here is if you take a look, there's a really great little app. Just downloaded it right from the App Store um, for my iPhone. And it says here, I know it's a little difficult to see, but it says get started. And it's asking if I have the leaf, I say yes. And I'm going to go ahead and put in this information. So it's asking if I want to allow leaf to connect to accessories. In this case, we do want to do this because Bluetooth is what's going to allow the leaf to connect to the phone. And additionally, the leaf doesn't have to always be connecting. It, it holds up to 14 days worth of information. So a lot of fitness trackers out there, you have to be Bluetooth all the time, drains your phone, really kind of sucks. In this case, and I'm going to go ahead and enter in this information here. I'm not going to show you guys how old I am. No one needs to know that. Okay, so it's going to say, ask us another couple questions. This is obviously the period tracker part of this. Um, I'm going to go ahead and hit next. And we're going to pull the plastic tab, which we already did. We saw me do that earlier. Because that was really exciting. Bluetooth on. So we'll see if we can go ahead and double tap. Oh, felt a buzz. I say yes, it is buzzing. It's a very soft buzz. It's not intrusive. You can't really hear it, but but you can feel it, but it's it's certainly not an angry buzz. So I am officially connected. And here we go. And I can set wake up alarms, I can set goals, set my cycle. Um, I do know that the more that you use this, the better it gets to know you, the more information it starts to, to get. And, uh, and yeah, as you can see, it is a beautiful piece and I'm really excited to try it out. So that